Hey Ross World, my money makes money. And you're trying to figure out, I'm trying to have some hard cash on hand in your flame, fireproof, retardant safe so you can get it to it at any time, whether it be an emergency because maybe you have everything set in your bank account and things like that. So this is a simple strategy, the envelope strategy, right? Quite simple. Some people use envelopes to pay bills. They uh, label their envelopes with different names of bills, electric, cable, uh, gas, so on and so forth, correct? Or you can also have an envelope that says slush fund or petty cash or splurge or however you want to name it. So every time you get paid, you decide what your budget can handle of how much money you can put in this envelope that you keep inside of your safe. Whether it be, oh, okay, I get paid uh, twice a month or I get paid four times a month and you put $20 in there every time you get paid and you never touch it unless you absolutely need it. So that emergency fund that's in your savings stays in your savings and then you have emergency fund on hand, okay? Because maybe, uh, say for instance, you lost your wallet. You're like, oh man, I, I can't get no money out the bank. I lost my wallet, I don't have my ATM cards, I don't have my credit cards. Yada, yada, yada. But hey, you've been saving up for so long doing the envelope strategy that you probably have um, a half a G or a thousand inside the bank or however long you've been doing it. So this is just a quick strategy for you to, to obtain and have hard cash on hand. OK, but make sure. OK, just my, just just some advice here. Make sure that money is in a fireproof safe. Because, you know, unfortunately events happen and our houses burn down. And even though you might have renters insurance or house insurance, they may not give you the money that you said you had in your safe. This is Ross World. Use the envelope. I'm out.